hobby people i'm back with another video and today i'm back with you already guessed it yet another scoop um this time i did order one individual scoop um i decided to do this because i was trying to do a comparison between one scoop versus two versus three versus four etc but um you know couture has since changed how they do the scoops so this one is actually i already know it's going to be a little bit of a smaller scoop but still wanted to come on here and unbox it for you guys if you all have missed my previous videos with Enel couture i am going to go ahead and leave all of my scoop unboxings link down in the description box below i went ahead and just created a playlist to make it a little bit easier so i will link that in the description box in case you guys want to see what i got in all of my previous videos plus me testing out his products in in more depth and giving more detail about my thoughts on them but let's hop into this video okay so this is my scoop this is my individual scoop i'm gonna go ahead and zoom out so you guys can see how big the package is um definitely not as big as past packages so this is now how big the single scoop comes like this okay and it's hard for me to do a comparison video because this is my first time ordering an individual scoop but i know that this round of scoops is different with how they package things and what's included because if you all saw my last two scoop unboxing you all saw where i compared what two scoops now look like versus what two scoops used to look like so um yeah i already know it's going to be a little different but i'm hoping that there's some products in here that i really want um this round of scoops what am i hoping for i'm hoping for the press it gel and i wouldn't mind getting some more of his marble inks and of course i would love more gel products and more of these tips because i love these tips so let's get into it okay so as you all can see here i did order that one individual scoop um and again the boxes are definitely a lot smaller you guys so um i feel bad so yeah, the boxes are definitely a lot smaller, you guys. I feel bad for those who are getting in on the scoops right now because I think this is really the telltale end of it. So I don't think you guys are going to get as many products as those who ordered in the past got. But I still think it's going to be a good value for what is included. So let's go ahead and get it open here, you guys. Ooh, okay. This one's a little bit different. Ooh, I see bubblegum gel. Yay! Okay. <laughs> I am happy already. Okay, I really love his bubblegum gel. So I'm gonna zoom in just a smidge and let's get into these stickers and all the other goodies that's in here. All right, so in this particular one, I got these here. These kind of look like some knockoff luxury stickers. Like this is supposed to be look like LV, a Dior, um, Chanel type stuff. So. That's interesting, but yeah, I got these knockoff luxury stickers. I got these really cute full cover nail stickers, so these look pretty nice. Oh, I got two of these. Sweet. Okay. got two of these, so that's nice. I also got a Mike candy box. I actually quite enjoy these little candy boxes a lot. I've given a few to my daughter, and so she uses it to store her like markers and crayons and color pencils and stuff. So these are really nice and handy to have. I also have a few of them where they store like the nail files. Speaking of nail files, we did get one. Um, so I also store a few of my nail files and such in there. So that's nice to have. Let's see, we got some more like little nail art items. Um, so this one here has um, caviar beads and these are in gold. It has this little item here that has some really cool um, this one looks really cool. I kind of want to see what this charm is in here. Let's open it up really quick. That's cute. I hope these bees don't get everywhere. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's really pretty. Look at that. I like this. I want to see what this charm is. Oh, how pretty. It has like a little pearl there in the middle. That's nice. And then we have like these like huge fuchsia pink charms. Got some purple caviar beads. I don't think I have any of those. So these are nice and fun. Got a few of these. Okay, we also got these. Oh, very cool. So this one here is like some gold embellishments. And I guess it's in number 96. And this one comes with just like a lot of like the little gold feathers. It comes with some really Oh, look at that butterfly. Wow, do you guys see this? Look at this. How gorgeous is that? It's a nice little surprise. That's super cute. So it came with that. And then it has these really beautiful, cool, like chunky rhinestones in here. That's really cool. I like that. That's gorgeous. 
So, and then it has like some feathers as well. So I got this one. Oops. <laughs> Alrighty, I also got, oh cool, I got some more of these caviar beads. These are like in gunmetal. I got these in my last mystery scoop. So I'm happy to have more of those. I did get some bubble gum gel, you guys. I'm really, really happy to have this. And it's in the color pink, which is so awesome. I am obsessed with this bubble gum gel, you guys. I'm not even gonna lie to you because it's really good stuff. I'm actually wearing the bubble gum gel on my nails right now, and it is in the color pink. Let me show you guys what the pink looks like. So this here is what the bubble gum gel looks like in pink. Let's see, this is what that color looks like and I have it on right now. And I used his uh, one, two, three, go tips in the color. I think it was like pink sugared glitter or something like that. And I just literally used the bubble gum gel. I literally just used the bubble gum gel to apply it and then did the top coat and that was how I got this look right here. So y'all, this stuff is amazing. So I'm very, very happy. Very happy to have another one of these. Um, yeah, this stuff is really good. What else? I got another monomer. Um, if you all saw my last video, you all saw me um, use this monomer in action. I will say that it is a quick dry monomer, meaning that uh, it sets really fast. So be mindful of that as you're using it. I do plan on using it for applying my press on nails with acrylic because typically when I do that method, I do like a faster setting um, acrylic and monomer. So I'm definitely gonna try that for the next time I do press ons with acrylic. And then also another uh, way that I thought about using this fast dry um, monomer because I'm not gonna be able to use this for sculpting a nail. I'm just not that good with acrylic just yet. Um, so I'm gonna be exclusively using this to make some nail charms, you guys. Uh, I think, um, you know, if you have like some silicone molds, I think it'd be great to have this, put it in the mold and then it sets really quick. So yeah, I thought this would be another cool way to use it in case you guys are wondering and got this in your mystery boxes as well. What else we got, y'all? We got some more Happy Gel. Oh my gosh, I'm excited to see him including more of these. Um, I plan to use these to apply my nail tips with, so got this. We also got, let me see, got some more Lux Wipes, okay. So can't have too many of these either. I did get these um, in my last few scoops, which I'm happy about. I've been using these um, to wipe off my acrylic brushes. I did try to use them um, with acetone, but I didn't really like the fact that the color, it just kind of like dissipated. So, and then it kind of tinted my nail that color. So um, I like using these to clean off my acrylic brushes with. All right, y'all, I'm so excited. Um, I'm a, yeah, let me go ahead and get into these. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. I'm really, really happy to have more of his Precious Minerals gel polishes. I actually really like these a lot. These might be my favorite of his lines that I've gotten so far. Um, I really, really like the consistency of these. Um, so let's take a look at these colors. Um, looks like I got 198, okay. Let's see. Oh, these are pretty good, ain't they? Okay, there we go. Ooh, look at this color, OMG, this is really pretty. This is a nice soft pearly pink color that has some really fine shimmers in it. Oh my gosh, that is really nice. I like this nude, it's a really pretty nude. Okay, so I got this. I think I have this color already, it's 172. This one's kind of like a jelly um, fuchsia pink. Yeah, I got this one in my last box. Um, so this one is really pretty as well. Really nice color here. Okay. And then last but not least are the items that we all have come to expect in these mystery boxes, which is the foils and the nail tips. So looks like I got four foils. Let's take a look at which ones I got this time around. Okay, so I got the full cover. I got the full color matte foils. And I like that they have like a rose gold in that. See a black, a gray, so I got these. I got these ones here. I actually don't think I got these just yet. Oh no. <laughs> I actually don't think, oh this mug jacked up. <laughs> I don't think I got these foils just yet. I have seen a few people um, with these and these are kind of like black and gold lace. Yeah, these are really pretty. See flowers on there. This one, did this one have lips on it? <laughs> I think this one had lips on it. Oh no, it's just another floral design. Let's see if I can get this in here. Okay, and then it came with this one. These are really cute. Got roses on it. Okay, so the back of this is really loose. I have to tape this up, but um, 
yeah so these are the other foils that i got like i said this is the first time i got these so these are really cute and cool next here we have the black and white lace which are really nice okay and then we also have these really beautiful blue kind of marbly really pretty uh foils and i did get these in previous boxes and so let's see how many nail tips i got um let's see here four so yeah it looks like four is the standard amount of nail tips you're getting in these boxes now i'm, I'm actually shocked about that because they used to come packed to the brim with the nail, nail tips and that's why i really enjoy getting these boxes because as you all can see i love them but let's see which ones i got okay so we got mini stiletto we got um, honey peach almond. I'm happy to have more honey peach because I really didn't get a lot of these in my previous scoops. So happy to have another one of these. We have the extra, extra long pipe shaped ones. And then we have honey peach coffin. So that's perfect. Like I said, I, I wanted more of the honey peach color. So happy to have these. And um, yeah, y'all, that's everything that's in the box. Like I said, these boxes, they didn't got straight to the point with a lot of items. Like I said, y'all, these boxes, they pretty much didn't got straight to the point these days. So. That is what the new scoops are looking like. Um, and yeah, let's get into swatching these polishes. 198. Ooh, that's a really pretty, kind of like nude pink with a gorgeous shimmer to it, glitter shimmer to it. Really, really nice. Yeah, I like this. All right, I'm going to do two coats of this with a top coat and I'll be right back. Alrighty, so this is what the two colors are looking like swatched out. I wouldn't, I didn't swatch this one again because, like I said, I had got it in a previous box. I wanted to show you guys what that color looked like. So this here is one nine eight, and this is a really beautiful, um, soft, um, pinky peach color that has some really beautiful gold shimmer glitter in it. And then one seven two, which is a really pretty kind of jelly fuchsia color. So I thought these two colors were really pretty. So these were the two gels I got. Um, I did get the happy gel and the bubblegum gel as well. So yeah, y'all, let's let me give you my final thoughts. This is everything that is that was included in this particular scoop. Um, this is what one individual scoop looks like nowadays, you guys. Um, I don't think he's doing them as big and as massive and as grand as he used to. And I think that might be due to limited inventory. I think he's finally getting his warehouse cleared out. So he's down to the tail end of the sale. Overall, though, I'm still really happy with everything I got. It seems like now the standard one scoop kind of has a format right so you get four foils you get four packs and nail tips you get a two gels um, and maybe a happy gel or another type of gel um, you definitely get the Lux wipes you get some um, nail stickers and then you'll get some um, nail arts um, not every single scoop I feel like includes one of these boxes here like the my candy boxes um because i don't think i got them in my last scoops um but i think they all will include at least one thing of lux wipes um not all of them include bubblegum gels i was really happy that i got one in mine because i absolutely love this stuff if you order you kind of take a little bit of a gamble these days um you're not guaranteed to get as much product um but it's still a good value for 20 bucks you guys like on his website i think this bubblegum gel alone is 15 dollars so this kind of almost pays for itself that and a pack or two of tips um i think the monomer was five dollars on this site but that's on sale so you know i definitely think it's still worth the amount I, I definitely still think it's worth 20 bucks you know so you get nail art and um all these other items too so yeah i i am still very happy and satisfied with my boxes i do feel bad for those who are just now getting in on the scoops i think i don't feel any type of way because i got a few of the previous scoops that were a little bit larger so i don't think i'm as disappointed because now i'm just looking to see if i might you know get a hidden gem in one of these boxes right so i think for those if this was your first scoop um and especially seeing what other people got in their scoops i probably would be a little bit disappointed but it's still a good value if you put things into perspective and also if you didn't see somebody else's scoop and you just got these items in a mystery scoop for 20 dollars, i think most people would be very happy with what's included in here so yeah i just wanted to put that out there um i am really enjoying his products do i got a couple more scoops on the way maybe i saw that he added some new ones did i place an order for that maybe so just stay tuned to the channel you guys um and we're gonna keep this little scoop situation going so stay tuned to the channel you guys i'm gonna be testing out more of his products i do also have now a dedicated email couture playlist so if you always want to see all of my past scoops as well as me testing out these products in more detail um it'll be listed there in that playlist and i'll leave that link down in the description box below and let me know have you all gotten recent scoops 
scoops and do they look something like this or are they still kind of those big scoops? Um, I'd be interested to hear what you think down in the comments below. I do hope you all enjoyed the video. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. If you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around, join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.